excited to see the inside. Put on your best imagination. tools and everything outside and kind of opening up this area and everything cleaned out. So. Yeah, um, yeah. Let's just and let's lay them. think <laughs> hey somebody's got to do the high risk filming right up here you feel better i didn't feel worried look it's like four feet it's not even far he thinks i need stair steps up there because i'm a little old lady in my damage in four feet. 
What are those? I don't know. They're just these big old jumbo. They <laughs> almost jumbo look like things. kibalsa. They're not kibalsa. Thank you. They're cold. You? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she says, sure. <laughs> Nicely done. Her mom and dad are going to watch this. Yep. <laughs> Good deal. We got some potato chips too, huh? Yeah, this is a good hot dog. I don't even want to know what's in it. It's beef. Beef? Beef hot dog. I just get really tired after lunch. I just need like 15 or 20 minutes. It's, it's the little, it's the little time, not a lot of time. Crazy dog. <laughs> okay, it's time to go back to work. That wasn't 20 minutes. Stella and I are done at the lake. We made short work of this.
Yeah, or... felt a couple raindrops. <laughs> Thank you. 
We will put the police on these corners because this is not as hot today and I don't want it blowing. <laughs> so here is here is the here you have the ingredients which are um, halibut okay the halibut fillets you've got them check <laughs> one and a half teaspoons of extra virgin olive oil one and a half teaspoons kosher salt uh, salt ground chili pepper preferably mm. Turkish or Aleppo no just just peppers Oh, you don't have brown chili pepper. Okay, cool. Two well, I have chili powder. Uh, let's not. Okay. And then two rosemary branches. I see that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. One small lemon. One small Filipino woman. Well, <laughs> that's not what I'm here. Okay. She for my check. <laughs> and one quarter cup slice. Pitted Kalamata other good quality black olives. What you do with these is just snap them at the very end and the woody part will come off. You don't want to eat that part, so we'll get rid of it. Okay. And just put it over here and then we'll put some olive oil and I stuff I think I can on. handle that. I think you can handle it. And... Well, it could get a little... I mean, this is good. <laughs> It doesn't get any better. Okay. Stone just, she's just. The company is great. The food is good. The food is good. The company's great. The view's even better. The view is fantastic. Yep. But you know, and I also love being here in the summer so much when everything's green and it's yeah. warm. The ease of getting here, I love that it's just. Mm -hmm. It's, you know, winter is, you work for it. Anything worth doing like this is you work for it. Mm -hmm. and, and the books that we've been reading, especially John McPhee's book, Coming Into the Country, that I'm reading, and you read about those people and how hard they worked in, in their cabins up along the rivers in the middle of the winter. Yep. I mean, it's, we're, it's, we, we're, it's not, we're nobody. We're no different. Oh. I mean, it's... You That is really storming out there tonight. 
thunder and everything. Yeah. I think that's the first thunder I've heard this year. Here. Yeah. So you think everybody's up for a sauna tonight? I'm up for a sauna. Tonight. You're up for a sauna? I think I'll go up and get the fire started. Come. Why is flexing in the window? <laughs> oh wow, it's toasty in here. It is. <laughs> it's perfect. Smells <laughs> so good. Well, I'll give you guys the, uh, the comfy seat over there. I'll give you guys the comfy seat. Hello. What do you think? I think it's great. <laughs> you need to sit, have to sit on it. Well, I was going to, I'm going to build a heat shield for yeah, the stove. Put some water on there so you get some steam. Yep, I was going to build a heat shield for the stove, but until I do, we have these pieces of sheet metal. But my golly, if you touch one of them, it'll leave, a, it'll brand you. Yeah. Uh, you want to put some water on it? Grab that cup, Dylan, and dip in that bucket, and you can. Uh, yeah, this cup has water. Is that? That's, no. that's my cold drinking water. Oh, Go ahead. It's not cold anymore. I okay. need to tell you. <laughs> okay, right there, you got some water in one of those buckets. Woo! Woo! That is freaking hot. Flash on you? Let's do that again. <laughs> <laughs> now that I know what's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that steam will stall you. <laughs> you wanted to take three. <laughs> Where's your ladle? Oh my gosh, I don't know. That's hot as heck. Yeah, and you're sitting over there. I'm over here. I'm about to die. Yeah. It's unbelievable. Ooh, the heat just boils right, off of that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I'm inside. I'm inside. <laughs> it almost makes me wish I hadn't worn this parka.
You know what I want to try? We need a little bit more steam in here. I'm gonna try it with this. You got Dylan is too much. Dylan, you're gonna you're gonna blow us up. <laughs> You've got to have an elf in your sauna, yeah. traditionally in Finland. And the elf is, you put him on a shelf in, in your sauna, and the elf is uh, kind of like good luck. A charm. A charm. So the, uh, you're supposed to save the, uh, the last bit of steam for the elf. Um, anyway, really good advice. I haven't gotten the elf yet. So, so hopefully I'm... we don't burn down tonight. <laughs> <laughs> elf, this one's for you. <laughs> no. This is your first sauna? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? If you need to step outside. You know. What do you what do you think of your what do you think of your first sauna experience? It was great. Yeah. Yeah. Like obviously. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I didn't know that. I'm gonna add a little more water. Oh my goodness. Just a little bit more. <laughs> I am literally dying. Okay. <sighs> oh my god. <sighs> what, we're about probably 10 to 15 minutes in. Dad and mom have. <laughs> Dad and mom are back. They retired from the sauna. Watch what she, watch what she said. <laughs> Cooler over here. <laughs> oh. Is that over there? Yeah, because I'm, I mean, I'm right next to the flame, so yeah, you're sweating. It's got to be at least another 10, 15, 20 degrees warmer just right yeah. here next to the fire. Okay.